Hey guys, it's your friend and neighbor now, and we're back again with another episode of Resident Evil 4. Now, if you guys remember in the last episode, we got to the church and we got to Ashley now, as you can see right here. And yeah, it's gonna be a whole bunch of back and forth from now on. If you guys don't know what this game has in store for us, then let me just tell you guys, we're in for a while, bro. Like, it's low key annoying, but it's so perfect at the same time. Like, I'm really interested to see how that remake's gonna handle Ashley and all that. And you see that barrel route over there. If Now, if we get out our pistol, and we come over here, we can actually shoot this barrel. And get that sweet collateral. Reload. And... Okay, I thought your head was gonna pop there. Him. And he's dead. The other guy isn't though. But he's gonna turn. I knew it. Straight up knew it. Don't you dare. Now lie down and think about what you've done. Alrighty, now, if you guys remember from the last episode when we came through here the first time we went in here and we got the stuff. Now I believe if we go back in here we're gonna get raffle ammo. Or gold. Now what do we have in here? Nothing. So yeah apparently with some of these boxes if you loot them once and you come back through after a certain point in the game. You can actually come back and loot them again. It's really cool. Not gonna go full through that with every single box obviously. It's gonna take way too long. But it's just a little thing I thought you guys should know. For those of you who don't know about it obviously. I mean this game is so old, it's, I've heard it's actually a fan favourite in the franchise, so Welcome. yeah. And what- Oh, we have a red lamp for sale. What are you Sweet. Selling? Don't mind if I do. Ah, Here we can sell that for 27k. What are you buying? Ah, a choice of an avid gun collector. It's a nice gun stranger. Indeed it is. And it's antique as well. Mouser C96 for those of you who don't know. The nice gun, and it's also, I believe you might recognize it as Han Solo's blaster from Star Wars. I still want to know where the window comes from. Okay, Ashley, come with me, quickly. Wait. Get him. Take him down. Okay, there's no one. Okay, there is one guy behind me, but he's quite far away, so we'll deal with this guy quickly. Oh, for once the analog drift actually helped me. Reload, please. Oh no, he's gonna kill Ashley. Or try and kidnap her. Okay, come here. Come here, you. Now sit down. That's right, sit down. Think about what you've done. Please, ah, oh, crap, that loot went away. Well, it's just a little bit of cash, it's not really gonna affect us too much. And one thing I forgot to check when we first came through here was inside here. As you can see there's a barrel with some gold in it and there's a note. Sarah and the third party, okay you guys know the drill. Just pause it if you want to read through it. And now this woman wants a piece of me. Oh that's a, that's a guy this time with the torch. Oh no, reload. Okay, come oh. Ashley, quickly. Where is she? Okay, this is actually kind of creeping me out here. I heard a woman's voice, but I don't know where she is. Okay, she's not up there, so she must be downstairs. Now we, Ashley, you can come with me. Stay close. There's a guy down there who wants us. And he. That was a pretty solid shot, if you ask me. Okay, the analog the controller just lost connections there. You thought, son. They want to smack me around. But well, nothing else when the thing happens to you, is, is it? Okay, actually, come with me. Catch up. 
Now I believe if we go around to this side, over here there's actually treasure underneath here. There's gold, and probably more gold. Or nothing. And get that. I was literally standing right in that bear trap. Did you see that? I didn't go off, I don't know. Yeah, come with me. Now you get over the one, please don't get yourself lost or whatever. Yeah, I'm thinking we do two chapters per episode. Or two sub chapters per episode. And I should probably heal before we start this next part because it's gonna be a rough ride. Truly a fall. Get the shoddy out. Leon, I have some bad news. I'd rather not hear it. Well, I'm afraid I have to tell you anyway. We've lost contact with the chopper. Someone must have shot it down, though we can't determine who. Great. We're prepping another chopper for you. Meanwhile, I want you to head towards the extraction point. Got it. Okay, keep moving. And cutscene. What are we gonna do, Leon? I hate to say it, but we're sandwiched, all right. Quick, in that cabin. I saw that reference there. If you know, you know. Let me know in the comments if you know what he meant there. Leon! Small world, eh? Well, I see that the president's equipped his daughter with ballistics, too. How rude! And I don't believe there's any relevance with my figure and my standing. Who are you? Oh, oh excuse me, your highness. Perhaps the young lady might want to introduce herself first before asking someone his name. Her name's Ashley Graham, the president's daughter. Is she... Well, you know. Don't worry. She's cool. Eh, never mind. There's supposed to be some kind of obvious symptom before you turn into one of them anyway. <gasps> Look! Ashley, upstairs! Okay. It's game time. Let's go. Okay, Lewis, I need you to get out the way from me, buddy. Block that off. Block this one off. And block this one off. Just buy us a little bit of time to search the area. Okay, grab that quickly. Grab this. Grab that. And then there's base for that's great. Absolutely perfect. Yeah, it's okay. We there are space for that. Because we can just combine it with that. And there's no space for the incendiary. That's okay. We can get it later. Once we shut out the better by ammo. Ow. Oh, they're coming through this side as one well now. Looks like they broke through everything. I don't know why that doesn't register with me as one now, but yeah. Kinda just happened. Okay, flash out. Oh, I can shoot him first. I'm getting so much shotgun ammo, it's crazy. Okay, Lewis, get him. I cover you from over here. And heal. Yeah, Lewis, go. I'll be right behind you. And knock the ladder down. Just keep knocking him down. And reload the raffle. Come on, Lewis, please keep him off me, please. Lewis, you failed me. We're gonna keep the incendiaries because it's gonna come in handy for a later part. I don't know when it's easier. Oh, nice one. Nice one, dude. This is super easy once you get the flow. Ow. 
back to the front. I'm gonna... Oh wait, this Lewis gonna give me something. That push was gonna give me something there. This pop feels like it's been for longer than what it should've. There we go. And we're done. I'm really interested to see this part in the remake too. Like backing off. So, what do we do now? The bridge I crossed to. Ready, ready, controller. Get here's out. So I guess we have no choice but to keep moving. I forgot something. You guys go on ahead. Lewis. What are you hiding, mates? You are definitely gonna save. No, we may as well override that too. Now, let's head out the front, out the door. Come on, get out there. I really want to get some of the stuff that dropped before it despawns. Okay, he's got nothing new for us. Two boots. Yeah, this is the part I was telling you guys about that apparently got cut. From the game. Dang it, there's so much stuff, but I can't hold all of it. Can I combine anything? I can't. Let's go the this way, the left way. It's gonna be stressful, but yeah. It's not as stress for me, it's not as stressful as the right path. Like, will I have the ammo for though? I think I will. We can always give it a try. If we die, we'll go the left part. We'll go the right part. Yep, I remember this. The part straight up freaked me out as a kid. They're dead now. You know what? I don't want to use my grenades though. I really don't. Yeah, before I'm breaking neck, please. And he's gonna transform again. Come on. Get him. Oh, the music stopped, so I'll take it as a good sign. Hey, he doesn't see me. Come on, controller. Really, controller. And he's dead, just like that. Now it's time for a very stressful part. Very stressful encounter. We're just gonna reload that for now. First of all, we have to knock this ladder down to get down here. Now, raise it up, please. Go, quickly. Please. Ugh. I don't like it, and grabbing me. Key, whatever. No, let them come to me. Be like, quickly, please. And get my grenade out. My hand grenade, that is. There we go. I think I might have killed one of them. I did. Now we can take all this stuff and we can move. Move on. Now I know that there's actually a treasure around here somewhere. Okay, actually, you wait there. Reload, first of all. There's so many of them. And I walked right into that one. They see her doing a 360 and all that. Get away from me. Get all of them. I think it is. Alrighty, come with me, quickly. No, we're not gonna bother going for that treasure now. I mean, it's not an essential treasure to uh, help the aiders or anything. Get the rifle ammo. Now, for those of you who want to know what the other part is, the other part is the big boy, Al Gigante. I'm probably butchered that word, but again, I'm not Spanish. 
Wait. Wait, hold the door open. What's this? I can actually just keep, just hold position. Hold your position, I'm um, coming back now. And uh, before we even think of getting on this, um, go, not that, um, the cable cars. Before we even think of getting on that, we're gonna take our stop route on. We're gonna see you see this guy right over there. We're gonna straight up knock him off the cliff. And knock you off the cliff too. And now we can get on there and move on. Now Ashley, come with me again. Well actually wait there. Just wait there. Cause there's something I wanna go after here and you cannot come with me for that. There we go, shoot the TNT. Not what I plan to do, but I'll, that's something I'll gladly take. Yeah, no, no more of that left. Now we can actually reload and then we can get it up. And now if we go in here, we should have the last piece for the PS done. And we can get moving again. And there's the sexy mer merchants again. Sexiest man in this game, I'm telling you. And there's nothing you can do to change my mind. Okay, we'll take that and do the rest. Are you kidding me? I actually can't take anything right now. You know, I suppose we're. I suppose we can start a hand grenade. I mean, there's so many of those around. Wait here. You better stay outside. Ashley, go hide. Yeah. Hi, big boy. How are you? <laughs> what buttons are gonna be? That so would have hurt him too. Now get out the incendiaries. That was too close. I just wasted that. Wait for him to recover and burn him again. And burn him again. And now we can light him up. Reload and move. Thoughts. Hey, we got you. Fair enough. I always, I don't know why, when I was a kid, I always thought I was the funniest thing ever when the app pops out. I don't know when I was a kid, I had the most twisted humor. I still do. Like me, I remember me and my friend used to, used to do this fight just to end up busting out laughing as soon as the app pops out. It's like the sound that made it. It's just, I don't know what it is about that. I'm actually curious to see how they're going to do this boss fight. Is the area going to be bigger or smaller? About the same? I don't know. But I'm really happy to see that jump. Are you okay, Leon? I'm fine.
I'm fine. I'm just a little hurt at the moment. Thank you, Merchant. Please, buddy. You have to have help from me. Yes, thank you. First aid spray. I needed that. And my inventory is looking absolutely horrendous at the moment, but it's gonna have to do. Well, we'll sort that out as soon as we get the large case and reload. And I'll see you guys back at the other place. Yes, use the full side. Open up. And there's the castle. My favorite part of the scariest part of the game for me. Wait. For those of you who want to know why, well, I'll stick around and find out. Get back. Okay, we got the driver. Now, guys, for those of you who want to see a little trick here, as long as you keep your back towards that door that you came through, everything's gonna be fine, and there's some gold there. You should probably take that. Anyway, as long as you keep your back to the door, everything's fine, but the second you turn around, you have a bunch of guys falling behind you. Okay, let's go up to the side here first. Get that. Get that. And run. Run once again. Actually, don't, don't look behind you, just run. Stay close. And that's the chapter and buzz. I really hope you enjoyed this episode guys. And if you did, please guys, click the like button, smash the subscribe button and click the notification bell. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers guys.